Hello, today I would like to talk about whether resin bonded bridges are working for the replacement of posterior teeth. Most dentists think that resin bonded bridges are suitable only for the anterior region for the replacement mostly of lateral incisors. And if they use it for posterior teeth, very often they think they have to use a lot of retainers like you can see here on the left side of the screen. Here dentists used three retainers because there was a belief that would be stronger. But this restoration failed because as you all know, three times zero is still zero. So if you are using inadequate bonding systems or an inadequate design, where for example the metal retainers flex, it will come to a deep bond. Especially as the teeth have a differential tooth mobility, this high stress will lead to a failure and you see here is a failed restoration. What did I do to solve the problem? I used a single retainer made out of zirconia ceramic, which is a very rigid, stiff material. There is no flexibility, no bending. And then we have a good bonding system and we bonded a single retainer to replace this first premolar, so a little a small posterior tooth. And we have done this over the last 10 years quite often and none of such restorations failed yet. So we had no debonds and we had no fractures of the framework. So I can assure you it is safe to use um, resin bonded bridges to replace premolars, so the small posterior teeth. Um, uh, with a cantilevered restoration. If it comes to molars, we have to use a different design, but I will uh, show this in a different video sometimes in the future. So I hope that helps to understand that we can use single retainer, all ceramic, zirconia ceramic, resin bonded bridges for the replacement of posterior teeth if they are not too large. I wish you all the best. Bye now.